Hello everyone, this is Cal Caltrain Rail Fanner. Today, I decided I wanted to do a model train review because I wanted to show you my trains that work and do not work. Sorry if I have a running it. I'm sorry if I have. I just woke up. <clears throat> um. So here's what I'm gonna do first. I'm gonna open this box first and then I'm gonna show my trains that absolutely work and then I'm gonna go into the box I mean the basket of trains that I used to have but don't have any motors because you know I wasn't that kind of person back in like 2018 and those two trains over there and that train over there I'll do that for my last so let's open this box now just to make sure for all of you if you want to skip this all these trains do not work in this box. And I didn't break them, I just got them. So let's start off with this E unit. I don't know what number it is, but... Oh no, it's 580. Um, um, I tried running it, it did, did like didn't work at all. It just never moved. Like, let's uh, try to like, open the engine. The engine's openable, but I don't know. I'll ask my uh, John to fix it. Uh, this piece, I don't know where it goes. But I'm keeping that in the box because I think it's part of the engines. <gasps> no, it's part of the wheels. Okay. Now, here's something sad. Oh, crap, I hate that. It gives me, like, SD. <gasps> oh, oh, my God, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. Well, if I dropped it, it, it wouldn't change anything because this doesn't work. That was the sad thing. And it has a Bachman style couplers, and I don't have that kind of style couplers. And it's 381, my favorite engine. Why don't you get painted into the Maddie Railroad? Man. Uh, even if they're broken, I still would save them for my child. All right. Now, here comes the SD40s. Now, this one does not have any, like, this, 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 this the front is just messed up. The front, like, this thing here doesn't match with that. I think it went missing. Missing chassis part. <laughs> so, this is SD40-23808. Might be a Southern Pacific, ex-Southern Pacific locomotive. It doesn't work. I tried, but the only thing that works is the light in the cab. Because this thing is, like, used for, like, at night. <sighs> now, here comes the Burlington Northern. The Burlington Northern, 30, uh, 3896. I really haven't tried it yet. But I think it could work if I mix it with the Santa Fe locomotive. Because... This thing does, all these things almost have, only have a Buckeye style, like a Bachman style couplers, or nothing at all. I mean, this does have a Buckeye style coupler, but it's broken. Weird. Uh, it doesn't have a light, too. Okay, so here comes the next one. This one's kind of special. Alright. Now, the, while I was making this video, I accidentally left the camera app. So I have to retake this again. And I just noticed the hood is detachable. I mean the the the, the thing is detachable. Now I am scared to drive this thing because its engine is exposed. So I'm afraid like the sparks are gonna come out at the thing and uh Maybe I should make my model train railroad outside or something. Dang it. <sighs> well, that doesn't work either. I mean, I, I'm still pending on it. It might still work. It might work. I don't know. Or maybe it'll work to catch my house on fire. <laughs> All right. And here's a PRR locomotive. Now, don't get pissed, PRR fans. If there's nothing, then four more tracks. I don't have four tracks on my on my route. I did get new things while I was buying that. I did get a car wash and a farm and a 
another house. Uh, that's, I don't, I don't. Um, okay, so this does not work. Like, it barely even ran. It was like there was no motor inside it. Is there a motor inside it? Let me try to pinch it open. Alright. Alright, let's try to open this. Okay, I'm opening it. I know how to put it back on. Don't don't worry, Pennsylvania. I mean, I know you learned, but okay. This this kind of this is the interior. It looks like it. Yeah, it's definitely crooked and bashed out. It doesn't work. Definitely. So I'm gonna put this back on. I'm sorry, poor F unit. You were the only F unit in my soul. <sighs> okay, so now here comes this special one. Now I didn't know. Now I never saw this, but this is a like a like a cyber train. It looks like a cyber train. Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven Rail Fan Edition. Um, uh, um, <clears throat> I don't know if this counts as a locomotive, but I think it it could belong to. It could have belonged to anything. Like I don't know what what it belonged to, but at least the the engine's secure. So that's everything in my box. That's everything in my box. So I just leave that over there, and whenever we have time, I just let it fix. And those are aerosol things over there. All right. So now here's my trains that absolutely work. So. These are my three Santa Fe coaches I got while getting the box. Oh, if you don't know, <clears throat> this is sad. <clears throat> this is one of my dumb self. I, like, let it, like, go anywhere. And it barely ran. But if you go to my earlier videos, like, you know, remember that uh, Five Nights at Freddy's video where I just go, like, the trains? This thing actually ran. And now it's, now look at it. He wasn't even named in real life. And this here, just for show. Alright, so, <clears throat> I don't even know where to start. I have so many. I can't, it's filling up the entire shelf. Alright, so we got three Santa Fe Pullman cars. Two box cars. Right by the Boston and Maine and the Santa Fe Railway. And this one is, okay, don't get excited, Caltrain Simps. This is Caltrain 914. Now, don't ask where I got it. Actually, I just got it from Amazon. If you don't know, if you don't know where I get it, but that, that's just a bot. That's just something I could just just have. And now here are three Metro Holiday Train Coach cars, and here's an Amfleet Aviator and the old style uh, Pullman car, and Hopper, more freight cars, and the Metro F40 PH that came with that coach cars. And here's the, I have two of those things. One of them is like right here. I tried to use them while testing the two F40s and the F units combined. And I have super liners and an F45 and a B40-8. And P42s. Did I just mention that? Okay. So, now here we're going to go to the trains that just have no motors. Now, this was again when I still bought this thing. Now, if you're a veteran on my channel, I did have, oh crap, this, oh, I also had a Metro Lincoln 59 PHI 883, and I'm a monster, Cotton Belt 7033, I should put that up, I should put that up, that looks nice, nice, and a Metro Lincoln 59 PHI, yeah, it just doesn't work. I just like to put them up here. Rest in peace, F-59s. Everyone loves them. Now, here's some Pullman cars by Amtrak. I don't know where this thing went. I don't know where the bottom went. So, it was just a GP30. And, uh, I can't go down there. I do have a coaster at 59 in there. Let's just get the stuff out of the way. This HF scale tunnel, my mom accidentally stepped on it. And 
and messed it up. This so I don't use it anymore. Frankly, I don't because I use N scale. The, the, Alright, just keep this bag out of the way. Okay, there's the coaster stuff. Alright, let me get down here. Alright. Here's a Amtrak 157. It has no motor, if you can tell. It just runs like that. I actually used this in my case collision. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> now, here's a dome car. Oh, dang it. Where did that go? And it light. I think it never lit up because I didn't have that kind of track. Now, this one. Oh, jeez. All right. So, this one. There's a corgi outside. Just like. If you hear that, just don't get mad at me. That's not my dog. Now, this is a Santa Fe Dome. It's it's, it's actually kind of heavy. There's nothing in it. Oh, oh, my God. Okay, so don't get mad at me, Coaster fans. Ugh. I messed with this when I was like, look at that. Twenty-five oh three. Now, where's that F-59 at? Okay, there's a Union Pacific F unit in here. Ah, oh, jeez. Get out of there. It's 3001. Yeah. And it had a motor. And it did work. You did see, you did see it in my F and, F, F, F and A F trains video. I'm just going to put that back up there. Oh, Jesus, I almost landed on my computer. Alright. Guess I can go well. Match like Amtrak, match like F Amtrak F59. And, you know, yeah. And, uh, here's some coaster cars. If you want to see the cab car, I'll probably show you that. I just got to dig deep in here. Dang, I don't know where it is. It's a Santa Fe freight thingy. This the Santa Fe. Don't worry, I these things are already broken. I can't find it. I think. Well, I'm not even gonna bother. So I'm just gonna put everything back in there. Find everything I met, everything in here. Jeez. Ugh. All right, I did it. Now we gotta hopefully pull this mouth. Eating eggs in the way. All right, perfect. Okay, so. This was the very last, well, I know this isn't Model Train, but this was the very last P42 piggy bank before they restocked. And that actually looks really nice. All right, here's uh, this thing. I had this for like many years. Here is a F45, 5282. Now, while I was using this thing, I real look, the chassis broke off. And I don't know, because I let this thing, I let that thing on for display a while ago. Uh, and now I'm just going to sit there. Now, I do have a Phase 3 B42 DC number 53. It's pretty nice. It could work still. The coupler is broken. Now, in honorable mention, this thing. Uh, Put that down there. This thing. BNSF SD78, 93, 94. It didn't, doesn't work anymore. I'm trying to get it fixed, but that would take a lot of money, so. 
I'm just gonna let that sit there until like we get it fixed. So that was my model train collection. And I added my new decoration of room. Now, the dog says you should subscribe. Yay! Oh my god, but that dog. Um, so that's it. Bye.